I'm actually from the Netherlands and I'm living and working in Hernando here in Florida. And I make um, graphical impressionism and that means I work with an impression of what I see. These are landscapes and I take a flower out or I take a little water out. I can take anything out. And I like bright colors. This is an eye done in the same style. Um, there are more eyes I made. There are actually a series of them. And, um, try. and this is a landscape also with a dark background. Um, the paintings over here are more a story because this is the one who actually was first. I've done this for uh, the city of, of Inverness. They asked me to do something about the 30s, which is rather depressing. And um, I'm not a depressed artist, so I made a Dan, um, uh, sure, Charleston dancing in the 30s. And I took a dark background for the dark period of times with a rocky uh, to, to say that it's a certain time but it's still very cheerful and they're dancing and actually this is what is happening at this very moment too um, after the 30s I had to make Woodstock and then it's in the 60s so I made the 60s um, background um, was had to be orange there had to be um, this color purple in it that was a spiritual color we used a lot in the 60s People are dancing differently, apart from each other. Um, girls have flowers in the hair. There's a lot of flower power over here, and it's very cheerful. I think that's actually about the 60s. Um, this one is this my most recent one. Um, it is called Who's Watching, Who's Whispering. And I saw the image before my eyes, and I just made it. And I think you can see why it's called Who's Watching, Who's Whispering. Um, this is a triptych, which I made in the Netherlands when I lived there. I, at that very moment I had an exhibition in one of the older churches. And when I came out of the church, I had a solo over there. I said, I have to make something in heavenly blue. So I made this triptych and I think it is heavenly blue. It is also a landscape and I take a Yes, I live here since, I live and work here since three years. I come to Florida since 12 years. So I knew about Florida and I was known over here. Um, I live here and work here full time since three years. And I have a wonderful studio in Hernando. It is very bright. A lot of sun is coming, a lot of light is coming in, not sun, the light is coming in. And I think it shows, it shows in what I make. It is very colorful and I think living working in a bright light like this is encouraging me very much to work in these bright colors. I always was busy with art. When I was a very young girl, I, I took my pocket money to visit museums <laughs> because it was not so much in, in my surroundings. And I, when I was seven years old, my mom had to come to school to, uh, to see my, my pictures at the time which I was making because they were different from all the others. Since, I, as long as I know, I was painting and I was drawing and I've done everything. Watercolors, I've done everything. And I ended up with oil paintings and that is really what I love most. And most of the time it is my latest. It is always the latest. So this is who's watching, who's whispering. Because it is like, like a child. You know, it is, um, it is very difficult if you sell a piece. Believe me, it's a piece of your soul. Which is, it is, it is a part of you. It's not a thing. It is a thing, of course, but it is my thing. <laughs> um, this exhibition is here to the first or the third of February, so you're all welcome to see it, and you can see my art actually, because I think it's always better to see it real. <laughs>